Hi everyone, it's Katie and welcome back to my channel. Um, just to give you a bit of a heads up about this video, so today we are doing a Frozen 2 room renovation. A little bit of backstory, so um, we live in a rented flat um, and it's always been on the cards that we're moving, we're just, we know where we want to live so we are waiting for the right place to come up. And when we move, Alyssa has constantly said, when we move, I'm going to have a Frozen 2 room. When we move, I'm going to have a Frozen 2 room. Of course, the market is saturated at the moment. We don't know when we're going to get to move. And I thought, why should she wait? About two weeks ago, I was walking through Aldi. I spotted something that I knew would be perfect for her room. So I got it. And then that kind of tumbleweeded. And that's brought us to today. So about a week and a half ago, I popped on my Instagram stories. I'll pop a little thing in case you want to head over and check out my Instagram. I popped on my Instagram stories a little poll saying if anyone would like to actually see a mini vlog about the room renovation and everyone was like yes please so here we are. So I'm just popping on to do a little intro first, say hi and also to show you all the bits um, that I got for her room. Obviously we're in rented accommodation, we can't paint, um, we can't do any damage or anything, if we do then we have to repair it. So I've had to be very careful about what I choose um, to do the room of veneration, but at the same time I want to make it really obvious and I want to do, I want to make it really special for her. She so deserves it, she's been so good during all the lockdowns and everything and she's always really appreciative of anything that she's given. So first things first, let's take a look at all the bits that I got for her room. So I'm going to show you each of these bits individually and tell you where I got them from. I can't remember all the prices but I will tell you where I got them from in case you want to grab them for yourself. So the colours for Frozen 2 are like a minty teal green, um, a purple and a pink. It's not the blue and white of Frozen 1. Which is perfect because her room is like a minty green anyway. So I've gone with shades of minty green, shades of purple and shades of pink and we're going to tie it all together with a lot of fairy lights as well. So, first thing that I got was pillows. Lissa loves nothing more than sitting up in her bed and either reading or watching something or playing on her tablet. So I wanted that to be really, really um, cosy and comforting. So first things first is I got this absolutely giant teal um, bed cushion. It was the cover and the cushion um, all included and this I know was £15 and this was from b and believe it or not. Um, as I said it's absolutely massive if I hold it up you can't see me but you'll see the full size of it when the room is set up. So I've got that one. To go with it I got this pink velvet so it's velvet in the middle and then it's got shiny sparkly sequins all the way around the border. Again, this was the cushion and the cover included and this was from the range and I know that this was £12. So those are the two giant cushions that are going to be going on her bed. She already has a minty tealy green fluffy heart cushion so that will be the third cushion um, and then that's all done. So next up is I got a new throw for her bed so this is again like a pale pink but it's got like silver little dots all over it kind of so I wanted to see it was kind of like snow this was 5 99 and this was from the range also from the range she does have a rug in her room but it's very babyish that's one of the reasons why I wanted to do the room renovation I thought why should she wait she has got Still got the stuff that she had as a baby, she's got pink fairy ballerina um, curtains, she's still got a really babyish rug, so it's all going, and I'll show you when we've stripped out the room. So her new rug is this white fluffy faux fur wibbly rug, it's quite a small one, she's not actually hugely keen on having the rug in her room that she's got, so I'm thinking this small one, especially as it's soft and fluffy and furry, will just be perfect, I thought it was quite snow-like, I know I might be crazy putting a white rug in a child's room, but fingers crossed, so yeah, that is that, that was also from the range, but I can't remember how much that was, I think it was around 14 99 so she's got a white fluffy rug for her room as well. Moving on, and then we get more into the frozen stuff. So I've got some plain wired um, white twinkle lights, but I also managed to get a pack of these. I don't know if you can see them, but they are actually snowflake fairy lights. So they're all 
thousands and thousands of little, little mini snowflakes. So I've got these. These were from Amazon. And what I've done is, if I can reach them, here we go. So also from the range, I've got these command hooks. So these are no damage stick on command hooks. And we're actually gonna stick these to the ceiling above her bed. And then we're going to loop the snowflakes all over the top so that she'll have snowflakes. And then, let me lean out of shot. I've got these also no damage kind of stick on um, command picture hanging strips. I'm not actually gonna use these to hang pictures. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use the smaller one and I'm going to tape it onto the back of the battery pack for the twinkle lights and then I'm going to be able to hide that behind the curtain. So, Amazon, Amazon and the range. Next up, another one from Amazon is I've got this pack of 21 Frozen 2 wall decals. So these are really special ones because these are actually peel on and peel off. So you can peel on, uh, peel them off of here, stick them on the wall, but you can actually take them down, reposition them. And that was really important that you could remove them without damage because of us living in rented accommodation. So you can have a look there and see all the different ones that come. So she's got a um, built-in wardrobe that's got wooden doors so I can put some on there because she faces that in her bed. Um, I can put them all over the walls for her and around her mirror. Uh, so I think they're going to look really, really cute. They've got an Elsa set, an Anna set, an Elsa and Anna set together, and then they've got like all the um, elements from uh, this Frozen Two movie. Following on on the Frozen Two theme, she really, really wanted a nightlight. Um, she's not necessarily scared of the dark, but she does prefer to have some light, especially if she is now reading more um, in bed in the evenings. So I managed to find this little Frozen Two lamp that's got both Elsa and Anna on. What I really like is it's battery powered. Her plug sockets in her room are a nightmare. They're only in two places. One is under her bed. Um, and if we put a wire across it, that would block anything, her from being able to get under there because she has a lofted bed. And the other one is on the opposite side of the room and has her fish tank plugged in. Um, so I really, really wanted a battery powered one. So that is a little Frozen 2 battery light. Okay, next up is actually what started the whole thing. So I was in Aldi doing like a mega shop and you know they have those baskets of random bits and pieces as you go around the store. Well, I came across for 5 99 a set of three frozen canvases. So they're little square ones and we've got Anna, and we've got Elsa and then we've got Anna, Elsa, Sven, Kristoff and Olaf. And they're really nice, they're proper little canvas ones. They come with a little hanging on the back. And the set of three was 5 99 in total. And I just thought, you know what, I can't miss it. And there you can see as well, if you look in this one, you can see that the colour scheme, so you've got like that pinky purple, you've got Anna's purple, and then you have the minty tealy green as well. So, yeah. Next up is, of course, we couldn't do a bedroom renovation, Frozen 2, without the Frozen 2 bedspread. So this is the single Frozen 2 bed bedspread. There are variations of this that you can get. This one says, believe in the journey. It's got Anna, Elsa, Kristoff, Sven, and Olaf in. A giant snowflake on the top. Um, it's also reversible, so it's a really subtle, like, purple and white on the other side. But for the purposes of this room renovation, we will actually be putting it so that the picture is up. This I got from Amazon and I believe it was around £20 but don't quote me. And next up is, so she's had the same curtains since she was little. They were from Dunnell Mill and um, they're still in really good condition. They're like a pale pink, they've got ballerinas and fairies on them. Um, they're blackout curtains but she's just outgrown them completely um, so I'm going to be passing those on to someone. Uh, so I managed to get the Frozen 2 curtains and they again are blackout curtains because otherwise she would just be telling me she can't go to bed because it's still daytime. They are the blackout ones and again very similar to the bedspread. It's Anna and Elsa and Olaf um, with the different elements. It's got Gale, if you all remember Gale, the wind, um, that usually represented by leaves blowing around. So we got those. Now these were absolutely impossible to find on Amazon. They were always completely out of stock. 
I did have a look on eBay and people wanted an extortionate amount of money. So actually I got these from Argos and they were a really, really good deal. I spent £25 on Argos and I got these plus, which is still in its box, so I need to get it out so it didn't get ruined. I also managed to get the Frozen 2 um, shade. So yeah, I sent £25 on the two and that included delivery so we will also be changing her lampshade at the moment she's just got a pink one with like cut out butterflies on it but we are really really going into town with the frozen two things um and i think i've only got two little things left so obviously she's got the new curtains and i wanted to make sure that she because she does have hooks in there for tie backs so i don't know if you'll be able to, be able to see this but i got a spool of ribbon i'm trying to see um if it tells me the colour code, but I don't think it does, no. So I managed to get a spool of ribbon, which is this beautiful glittery tealy blue, like that. So I'm going to be cutting that up and I'm going to be using that to make uh, curtain ties. Um, if I've got enough, I may do some wrapped around her bed, but we will see the main purpose of it is just to be curtain ties. And then, oh, I've got more than I thought, of course. So I went to um, B&Q because that's where I got that big teal cushion. Um, they've got some really gorgeous stuff in at the moment. All their new homeware stuff is in. And um, they're very much on the tealy green, minty green um, and pale pink colours this year. And they've got the normal colours as well. But this means that their storage is also in. So I managed to get these gorgeous little baskets because kids always have so much stuff. So I think that one of these, I'm going to be putting all of her hair bubbles and bracelets and stuff in because she seems to collect those. And another one I might put some of her figurines in or something like that. So I got those two. And again, they were from B&Q. They had them in different sizes and different shapes. They also had them in plain cream, like a dark beige. And um, they had them in the, the pale pink, like I said as well. So I think the final thing is obviously I got some really decent batteries so that her twinkle lights and her night light wouldn't run out very quickly, only downside. And then of course you couldn't have a new Frozen 2 room without new Frozen 2 pyjamas. So I've got those and they've got Elsa on them and it says seek the magic on them and they're just really cute so I'm going to have those hanging on the end of her bed for when she gets home ready to wear. So that is all that I'm using to do her room renovation other than Mr Tutu. Um, so the next thing to do is to get clearing because her room is a pit. It always is after two weeks. Every time she goes to daddy's I clean and strip back her room and reset it for her. I think kids need a place to be messy. I think they need a place to just do what they want and she doesn't in the rest of the house. If she brings something out she always takes it and puts it back. It just doesn't go back in its place in her room. It just kind of goes on the floor. Um, so what we need to do is go tidy the room, strip it back and then start on the room renovation. So I will give you a quick shot of what we are looking at beforehand right now okay so this is her room beforehand as you can see it's quite a mess her drawer has front has come off so we need to get that back on but as you can see that's the rug we will be getting rid of there's nothing wrong with it just doesn't suit what we're doing that's the light fitting those are the curtains so it's all going to be going stripped back and we're going to make it magical so let's strip it back so here we go, her room has been completely stripped up. Uh, we've put all the toys away, books, everything, trying to um, set it up kind of how we're gonna have it. We've pulled her extendable desk out a bit so that her laptop can go on there. She does have a little really cheap laptop that Mr. Tutu built for her. So we've cleared this. This is where her doll's house was before, but you couldn't see it. Under the bed was such a mess. So we've just re-tidied it. There is a blanket up the back there, which actually, uh, blocks off the end that we use for storage she's got a blanket and cushions there and all her soft princess dollies and what we're actually going to do is going to put some fairy lights under there for her so we've taken down everything off the walls the only thing we can't take down uh, these flower decals that um, came with the room sadly but as you can see we've got picture hooks already so that's great bed stripped back it's just her cuddly toys and the blank duvet that's on there all the curtains are down 
the lampshade has gone. Her mirror's up there at the moment. Don't know if it's going to stay there. I may move it. Um, all her bits and pieces on there. That's all hair bands and jewellery and stuff. That and the that's all going to go in the little baskets I got her. And I need to get rid of this little brass tree. Um, all tidied away. The rug's gone. Um, the kitchen's all tidy. I will probably leave her A there because it's pink, but I don't know. We also took away any random like magazine stickers and stuff that she'd put on there and given the whole place a clean. So now all we've got to do is the transformation. So I'm not going to show you the progress because we're probably going to stop and start and try and decide where things are going. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to fade now to the reveal. So here we are, here is the final room reveal and I have to say I am so pleased, it looks amazing. So as you come in, there's a little doll's house, you're going to see decals everywhere. So there's her little jammies, Olaf trying to open her wardrobe and another Olaf up there, Anna and Elsa. That's the first canvas that we got, another wall decal, that's the second one we've got and then I'm going to pull back to the bed because I'm so pleased with her bed. So she's got that pink throw from the range, the mixture of cushions, these two we already had, and that one is from Matalan, that one is from B&Q, and then if you look up at the ceiling, those are her sweeped little snowflake lights that we got from Amazon. Um, that's the permanent setting, you can actually switch it so that they twinkle. We've got the lampshade, we've got the curtains. I found a couple of um, Frozen 2 bits she already had. So this is a little pop-up torch. And then we also have a little journal that she already had. And this is her battery powered night light, which you can turn around. And it also has Elsa on it too. And down here we've got her gorgeous little fluffy rug. I love the decals over here. So we've got the water spirit going up the wall. And then we've got Gail with Olaf and Sven down here. She only needed one of the little baskets. So that's just got all her hair bits in. She also has a blusher brush, but no blusher and a lip gloss in there. And that little pink box has got her jewellery in. And then we go over to this wall. I moved her uh, clock up here. She's got Elsa in some of the elements, and she's got the whole team, and then, nope, that was Anna, and she's got Elsa down here with some of the elements, and then the last thing, if I just close the door, she's got her Frozen 2 dressing gown, and a little Olaf poking out. We also completely decked out under her bed, so we've added some twinkle lights, all her soft dolls, she's got a blanket to sit on. And all those cushions, she can just go under there, have a read, or play on her tablet, or something. Nothing frozen under there, we've just made it a nice extra space for her. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the Frozen 2 renovation. As I said, I am beyond pleased, and so excited, and can't wait for her to see it. Now, do you remember that Mummy said that we were going to organise a big surprise for you? Yeah. Well, Mummy and Scott have been working hard all weekend and we've made a surprise for you. Is it good? It's in your room. Do you want to go and have a look? We made you a frozen two bedroom. <laughs> Whoa, is it... Don't pull them. Whoa. You got snowflakes. <gasps> Kristen, look at the bedsheets. Look, look at the bedsheets. Look, you've got Anna Elsa on your bed. <laughs> what? New cushions. What is this? That's your Anna Elsa light. And look, you've got another one here. <laughs> How do we turn it on? got a little button. Is that you? Yeah. And under your bed, we've sorted all out under your bed. You found this? Yeah. You found it. What else did, what 
and you've got new frozen pajamas. What is this? That's your little bag with all your hair stuff and your makeup bits in. What's this? That's your CD player. Look, and you've got a new rug. Oh my god, she's so soft. And look, Anna and Elsa are on the wall. Look, this has been pulled out to make you a little desk. So you've got a desk now. <laughs> new sparkly blanket, yeah. new cushions, <gasps> new frozen jammies. I want to wear these new jammies right tonight. Uh huh. Do you like it? Yes, I love this. I love the screen. I want the screen for this. This is so fun. Thank you, Mummy, for the best advice. And Scott, family cuddles.